Hey guys, what up here, and welcome back to NASCAR K3 Kermo, part number 87. We're going to be doing Iowa in the Xfinity Series, and I'm scared. Very scared. Uh, Iowa's never been very kind to me. I like racing here, but the AIs are just so OP. It's just, it's hard to have fun when they're so good. Uh, we did the truck race off camera, got 18th, and didn't really get much money of anything. We did get our sponsor bonus, so we did get, get uh, like 49000 something from that, so that was good. Settings, uh, we're gonna change those back to what they normally are. We always, you know, change it for when we go to the, the you know, trucks, so we don't, I don't spend like 20 minutes doing that. So, all that looks the same. Now, we're gonna go into the facility, and we do have enough money to get the next upgrade. So, we're gonna go to improve equipment and get the one that has the uh, better engine suspension, best handling out of the car. Yeah, we're gonna go with that for 2.4 million. And there we go. We got suspension at 100 max. Now we'll go to the employees. We don't really have too much money left here to really improve them. So we'll you know, improve Mr. Chris here by by one. And that pretty much is almost all we can do. I'm pretty sure. I think Wiggins, I don't think I can even... No, I can't. But oh, we're like a grand short. But yeah. So let's go to the adjust the work plan and uh, get everything ready. I think we'll be going into this one with a 90... 7 or 98 engine not sure or chassis suspension i can't talk and there we go everything's ready and we got chicagoland daytona on the list next i think at chicagoland we can more than likely win daytona still not sure daytona i don't know yeah everything's okay proper let's get into it see what happens and i don't know what to expect we do have the sponsor objective to get a top five I don't think we'll get it here, but I mean, I can try, I suppose. And we're going into this with a 97 suspension, so. Okay, that's that's the amount we're going to be going into. That's, that's okay. Off turn four, best laps a 23 2, and this one will be a 23 6, and that's 18. That's quite literally where I ran in the truck race when I qualified here. That's lovely. And that's not gonna, it's not going to be a fun race. So that's, I'll, I will say that much. It's. Not going to be fun. First Rebel's on the pole. Good for him. We're using an EPID gaming setup here from Heat 2. Because there's not one from Heat 3 that I that I saw that could be good. So, I, I don't know. Well, here we go. We're starting 16. So, two people got dinged in qualifying. Which is very good. Matt Tift, again. Just chokes. Spencer Gallagher. I can't even roast Spencer Gallagher because he's not my rival anymore. So... For once, it's the one-year anniversary where this rivalry began. I feel bad for him there. What a what a redemption arc. Michael and that's still out for blood, though, so we still got to watch out for him. Green flag's out, and we'll try to sour something here. 14 lap stage, we'll probably pit the end of stage one and two, just to be safe. It's just from like from just how the truck race went. Oh my god. Wow. I mean, you cannot get much more of, a, of an asshole than what Michael Annette just did right there. And I'm going to get the worst of it. Well, isn't that a bunch of shit? Thanks. We'll lose a spot to Joey Gase, and here comes Tommy Joe. I just can't believe that. Michael Annette is the sorriest sad sack of potatoes I've ever seen in my life. It's like... It's pitiful. And he just, he just gave me zero fucks. I don't even know what this car is truly capable of because oh, almost a Corolla. All right, um, I don't know what to expect. Maybe we can get by Tommy Joe Martins. So that should be the big goal for the stage. And okay, we gained a spot. Oh boy, don't look now. I wasn't expecting this, folks. We made another pass. Not quite. Okay, now we made another pass. I wasn't expecting it, folks. I honestly thought we were done, but nope, I was surprised. Well, we got to the inside of Ryan Reed for 13th spot. So far, the car, to my amazement, isn't hot garbage like how the truck series was, because at this point, we were like running, just falling back, and we were just slow. So... Maybe, 
I don't know. I mean, it, I, what I did, what I did, I can't fucking talk. Very stressed out lately. Truck series, I was in a five-star ride. I'm going to assume that if I ran my own truck, it would have been faster than the five-star. That's what I'm going to assume. It's interesting. I'm still not 100% sure how the whole star... Oh, wow. We just wrecked Austin Cedric. <laughs> well, that's... You know what? He deserves it. He's a piece of shit, so... Fuck him. I didn't... I, I, I meant it. I, I wasn't, it wasn't an accident. I meant to do that. Hmm. Actually... This... This is perfect. Okay, we're gonna pit, get four tires and fuel, and then we're gonna stay out for stage two, make it all the way to the end there, and then pit. And we can maybe cheese some better spots that way. This might be the an ingenious strategy call. Ooh, this is a good, this is a good. We're only gonna have like a few laps here. Okay, or just basically green and white checkered. We'll get a good start here, try to make up some spots as these drivers will likely pit here. They probably could stay out, I'm thinking. Even if they do, we do it, we, we will have better tires. Even though it doesn't feel like the tire fall matters in this game compared to them. But we should at least have a little bit better of a chance. Theoretically. I don't know about factually, but theoretically we should. And we did get a really good start because we kind of got ourselves to the inside right away. And we'll move up some spots. And looks like Christopher Bell's going to... Okay, the bottom lane just stacked up, but Christopher Bell should win stage one here pretty easily with that much of a contest. We're going to turn three. Reddick chops my nose off. We'll just try to, you know, keep it to the bottom. Okay, I thought Tommy Joe was going to get by me, but he didn't. We'll get 17th in the stage. Everybody else should be put in here, and we should cycle back out into lead, which will be pretty fucking awesome. And then we can see if we can actually hang on to that. And those people that pitted... Are they... Oh, they're staying out. Okay. Okay, that didn't really uh, work out in my favor then. A couple people in the back are pitting. But... Yeah, that didn't... Uh, that didn't work out, but the good... I, th I thought I thought I had a strategy in mind. God damn it. Alright, well, again, we're on the inside, so, I mean, we'll get another just great restart and gain some spots that way I suppose that sucks I was expecting them to all pit and I'll get the lead yet there but it didn't it didn't matter but, but we are on fresh fresher tires compared to them I don't know how much that'll matter but it's it's a thing oh god don't hit trusty okay. I'll just kind of chill on the bottom here we might get some stage points here for lucky if we're lucky. Just dive it into turn one. Don't... See, that's the thing. Like, I keep... <sighs> I'm sorry. I'm... It's very hard to, you know... I'm trying not to underdrive the corner so I don't get ass ran from behind. Or get have their little nose poked in the thing. And I'm trying not to overdrive the corner where I run into them. It's a very hard balance to mix when the field is all up your ass all the time. And we're going to fall back to probably 15th, which is lovely. You know, just can't escape mediocrity here. So we're going to try to get back down the inside of Clemens. I was a little bit aggressive. And the guys are very wrecky today. I mean, that was just a little touch. And normally, that wouldn't do shit to them. But in that instance, it, it really, it really, the car didn't like it. Oh, my God. Okay, stop. Stop hitting him. Okay, can we chill for a lap? I like I would like that. Okay, we clear Josh Williams. And don't hit the fucking apron. And let's uh let's just just calm the fuck down everyone. Yep, there it goes again. They just they just fucking stick it. St <laughs> How many times am I going to complain about it until they actually fix it? How about how about them like doing all this esports crap how about they actually fix core elements in the game before they try to get esports ready it's it's so it's so hilarious i get here we go folks i'm on a tangent i'm on a tangent i'm angry the esports thing oh my god where do i begin 
One, how could you even have an esports thing ready when the online isn't 100% ready there? And also, how can you have one when you don't even have a time? You, the, the, you, you, the host has no control when the lobby starts. There is just a forced timer. Absolutely stupid. Absolutely fucking stupid. Bugs me to no end. And then if people want to spectate, there's not even, like, any way to indicate who the hell is leading. There's no, you know, laps to go, the positions. Instead, you get, you know, you get the nationwide logo. Instead of things that will be actually kind of integral to knowing what's going on in, when you spectate. Like, this is shit that was, like, in games from, what, decades ago? I don't think this is, like mind-boggling things I'm, I'm i'm elaborating on here let's just finish up the stage i'm, I'm tired of bitching oh god is that's another car that's blown up first it was carl long and now it's somebody else and are we gonna get stage stage points from that jesus i guess so well we're gonna get ninth <laughs> wow, what what an incredible series of events but We got a lot of damage though, so that's gonna kind of kill us Is Anybody staying out? Nope, all right. Well, we got two seconds of repair damage. So that's gonna kill us like probably five laps five laps. <laughs> Two spots probably All right, well, well Let's see uh, where we cycle out and it's 13th. That's not too bad. I was expecting a, a, maybe a lot worse, but that's good. All right. I think I think Mike. I think we're past Michael and that. That was just a weird incident. That that car blew up like that. I mean, it was just very weird. Yeah, we get a hell of a start. Get to the inside of Sieg. Don't hit the. Oh, I did kind of hit the apron. Now we're gonna be four wide. That was almost an, an absolute disaster. God damn it. Fucking car. Oh, here comes Michael and Nat. Want to give me a bump? Oh, oh, he thought about it. And, oh, guy, you're not clear. We'll just use him up a bit. Ew. Just gotta clear him. And then we got a little bit of ground to chill for a little bit. That would be very nice. Okay, we're good. Michael and that's right there, so that's gonna be some problems. Don't don't fucking don't you dare pinch me off the damn track. Oh, he's gonna hit me. He's gonna he's gonna hit me. I know it. I just I just feel it. Just get to the corner. Get to the corner. The counter will not continue. Or it it kinda did, but I won't I don't want it to be extended. Okay, it's pro it's probably gonna happen. He's just he just keeps being on my ass. On lap 45, got 18 laps to go. We're on we're about five laps short on fuel. I don't think we can save that, even with the little bit of off throttle time we have around here. I don't think it's enough. We're pulling away from the people behind me, unbelievably enough. Just been kind of chilling here, and you know, we'll just you know, keep going. Really got nothing more to say. Look at how much of a badass Ryan Sieg is. He just flat out drove right around Austin Cindric. I tell you, give Ryan Sieg a good, good, some good equipment, and he'll he'll be pretty good. It, it oh, I like him so much. What? Oof. That is probably the most heartbreaking thing I've ever seen in my life. He pass he passes Austin Cindric, and his car was it just it, it couldn't handle it, and it just it stacked him up, and now Cindric can't get by him, and now there's just a conga line behind them all. Oh my god, that's that's so tragic. I was just praising him and then his car just explodes. That's the third engine failure this race. Carl Long, somebody else, and then him. I I'd never seen this many engine blowouts in one race. It's it's been a weird one. Oh my god, we can just never have a race play out. We just, it never it never can happen. Now watch, here we go, folks. I'm gonna pit again. I I have to take right sides. My lefts are or my rights are at 21 percent So I'm just gonna put in a, basically a splash of fuel, right side tires, and we're gonna lose a lot of spots. Guarantee it. Because everybody else will take no tires. <laughs> and it'll fucking work perfectly for them. Maybe I'll be wrong. Maybe I'll be wrong. I don't know.
trying to have faith. I'm trying to be optimistic. And of course, of course, we just we fall back to 16th. You know how dare I take right sides? I'm just an, I'm just a lunatic for taking right side tires that attract that that burned up the rights up to what 21 percent. That's frustrating. Eight to go. And it looked like I was the only one to really, like, get hurt from that. I'm sorry, Tommy Joe. I, there's, I sh you don't deserve that. Okay, Cinder, go go have fun. I want to get back to the bottom. Oh, he stuck it. it, it yeah, it worked for him. Oh, God. Ooh. Okay. Seven to go. Let's get by Tommy Joe. That was a, you know, that was certainly a pass, but I, I definitely didn't want him to cross over. Now we got Michael and Ed back there wanting blood, so I gotta get the hell away from him. I just can't believe it. Like, how did I lose that much ground? Did they just take no tires? Did they just take fuel? And if so, they really should not be to the point where they're that fast. Again. Oh, God, I'm sorry, Tommy. He doesn't deserve any of this. This beating I'm giving him. Just gotta get by him. He's holding me up a little bit. Oh. Con good good contact model game. I appreciate it. Alright. Ooh, God. Alright. 16th? I was gonna say, was there no caution for that? But, we're good. Man. I can't... I... How many years is it gonna take for that, that, that little ping pong shit to go away? God, that's like... It never ends. It never fucking ends. Why do I play this game? Oh, God, I hope you guys enjoy this. Right. Well, we're back to pretty much where we... The only thing that might be positive is I can maybe be as a top ten if we only have two to go. That's the only thing I can think of that's positive. Amazingly, that took a long time for that caution to kind of rear its ugly head. I was kind of surprised with that. Two to go. And, yeah, we get another disgustingly good restart try to get to the inside we might be able to you know steal a top 10 out of this which is going to be amazing for iowa standards we'll just dive bomb in the corner lean up against them it didn't do anything right shrix no no i i can't stand them poking their fucking nose through there like that and yeah he still he still stuck it even with that awful ink you know he's fucking perfect oh my god Let's get through this corner. I don't even care if I get by Cinder. Just give me a top 10. Just give me a fucking top 10. No! No! Ugh. God, I can't stand this. They fucking... My throat's gonna really... It's really fucking hurting. I need something to drink. God, this game makes my fucking voice go hoarse. All right, replay time. Well, uh, we don't really know why that one Kosh came out when I was chilling in like seventh. It's just a mystery. I, we, the world will never know. It just goes from that and then it goes to the restart. <sighs> Lovely. Yeah, there's that one caution with the ping pong. I really want to, to really emphasize how dumb this looks. I'm just driving, he just taps me a little bit, and I get on the apron and it whips me around. It's just... What a joke. What a fucking joke. Well, we got a top 15. A solid run. I'm sure fucking Michael Annette's gonna roast me and then Gallagher's gonna be mad. Priest won, good for him. Tommy Joe 8th. And we're gonna get not really not good. This track pays so bad. We won't get more in Merch Pal than anything. But yeah, we we do definitely, well, we got the cup hot seat, I think, this weekend to boost up that money and then we can improve our our stuff. So I'll wait till after that's over. 23, oh, I was still three tenths off, four tenths off the fastest lap. That's, that's still depressing. We'll have one more race to get that incentive contract. But yeah, it's, I don't know. 
Careful. I know, Clemens. Be careful, even though, you know, whatever. Tommy Joe is so nice. It, 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 I, 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 thank, thankfully, that was all the messages. I mean, we kind of caused a shit show. So I'm glad only one person was upset. It's the cup race. We'll sim that. And we should get something back from that. And then we'll see what the next week brings. But we'll definitely have more than enough money to really uh, get the upgrades and stuff we need. To at least uh, max out our suspension to 100 across the board for our employees, I think. That's really about it. Quickly reply to those guys and we'll see what the next week is. Okay, it's another Xfinity one. It's gonna be at Chicagoland. Okay, that's nice, that's nice. We don't we just head straight into that, so you know I can I can, you know, mess up mess with the uh, the things to uh, improve the em employee stuff. Let's go to the facility and get that stuff going. Uh, whoever uh, yeah, who, who do we need here? Uh, okay, Wiggins. Okay, he can be... We'll put him at 14, and then we're going to go over to Chris, and then we're going to bump him up to 15. 149,000. I think we're going to have just enough to upgrade the suspension. Yeah. But we're about 80,000 to the good. Perfect. And now we'll go over to the uh, work plan and get stuff ready for Chicagoland and Daytona. There we go. We're not going to be going into Chicagoland with a 100 suspension, but it's going to be a 98 suspension, which is which is good. So next race, without any question, we'll have a 100 engine and a 100 suspension. So that's about it for that area. I think in the points we're still leading it. I didn't even pay attention to it. I was so just flustered. We'll check the not the scheduled standings, and yeah, we have it by a good good bit surprisingly. And yeah, if the chase were to be playoffs were to begin, we have a 30, a 32 points added. And yeah, first rebel who has no wins is ninth. Hmm. A lot of first time winners. It's basically me and Hammer that have only won multiple times. It's it, it's interesting. Well, that's about it. Um, that was about how I expected uh Iowa to go. A big shout out to my tier 3 Patreon supporters, the Del Rollins, Weather Bros, Kamikaze Games, Ryan Lazar, and Dave, 500 Champ 15, Jeff Gordon, Racing News Now, Alan Gray, Matthew Murray, Motorsports Games, and Preston Carpenter for a donation again. I can't ever thank guys enough for a contribution and support to the channel. It does mean a lot to me. And considering I'm still likely in this, you know, to, you know unable to monetize my video thing, this, uh, your guys' help uh, means so freaking much right now. You don't even, don't, I, don't, I can't even express it. I'll see you all next part for Chicagoland. Do you think we will do another one, like a Daytona? I'm not sure. Depends on how Chicagoland goes. If we just crush them and, like, nothing happens, then well, I guess we'll throw in Daytona. Then that means I think the video will probably be over 30 minutes. But, hey, two-parter in one video. So that that's good. We haven't done that in a while. But Yeah, that's about it for me. I'll see you all next part, and I'll see you all later. And as always, have a good day, everyone.